So we're in uh, Parma, Idaho, and we're looking for this uh, free place that we found on uh, campsites, freecampsites.net. It's called Martin uh, Landing. There's a sign right there that says 5.5 miles. We got a few things done today. We got um, had that issue the other day with the tire on the trailer, so we found a Les Schwab today, and got both of our new spares put on the trailer. Then bought two new tires, and then took two of the other tires that were on the trailer and have them for spares now. So we have all new. Um, tires all the way around on the trailer, so now we're trying to find this uh, tree spot up the road here. Exxon Road. Yeah, that's right. And then we'll turn on Scott Pit Road. than most A campgrounds. Yeah, it's got the nice green grass. That even looks like a pool through right there. Yeah, what a neat place this is. Sometimes the free campsites are better than the pay ones. Even got a little more even marked. That one there is pretty nice. There's another water thing there. Even got 
Oh, that's probably the boat launch down there. Good morning, guys. Um, we found a neat little uh, free camp spot. Uh, it's called Martin's Landing. Um, and how you get here is if you're going through Parma, Idaho, you're going to turn on Roswell Road, which is at the northern edge of town. And um, once you uh, get on uh, Roswell Road, you're going to see all the signs for Martin's Landing. There are these brown little signs, and it's pretty well marked on how to get here. Um, you can also find it on freecampsites.net. But uh, the length of stay that you can stay here is uh, three days. That's what it says on the sign. Uh, maximum stay. But... Uh, Really nice big sites, even the uh, big motor homes I, I think would probably be able to fit in here fairly easy. Picnic tables, barbecue pits. They do have a um, donation box um, in here. Also there's a, a road, access road that will take you down to the Snake River where you can fish. Um, there is a camp host in here and he lives in the uh, in the big school bus or conversion type bus that uh, you'll see when you come in and his name is Tim super nice guy and uh, there's all kinds of uh, birds in here we've seen some uh, pheasant uh, we've heard some turkeys there's those little black and white um, oh magpies I think they are that's what they call them and uh, just all kinds of neat little critters that we're seeing around here. Deer. They spooked a deer last night. Um, right there, that tree that's uh, by the trailer, there's a little spot there. Um, you can see where the deer been bedding down at night. And I took Maggie out last night and I spooked it and that thing jumped up and ran off in a hurry. But, um, man, what a great little spot for... Uh, for free you know they even have these water spouts water spigots that are close by they have uh, you know just some outhouse type uh, bathrooms but um, boy if you guys are in this area you might want to check out this place it's called again it's called uh, Martin's Landing but um, I think we're heading out of here today there goes a magpie right there can sure hear him. I don't know if I can zoom in on him and hold the camera still enough for you to see. It's yeah, well the car. other thing too I forgot to mention is it's about uh, five and a half six miles from town but um, it sure is worth the drive back here. It's nice and quiet and uh, all you hear is the birds the birds and the turkeys and all that sort of stuff, so um, we'll catch you again. You guys have a great day.